These are the conversion factors that you need to know for GCSE maths. Start with mass. One ton is a thousand kilograms. One kilogram is a thousand grams. That makes one ton in terms of grams, one zero 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 zero. That's one million grams. You also need to know that one gram is a thousand milligrams. Time. One hour is 60 minutes. One minute is 60 seconds. So one hour in seconds, six times six is 36, and the zero and the zero make two zeros, 3,600 seconds. Length. One kilometer is a thousand meters. One meter is a hundred centimeters. One centimeter is 10 millimeters. That makes one meter in millimeters, one zero zero zero, a thousand millimeters. Do you need to know any imperial units such as inches, feet, yards, miles? The conversion factors will always be given in GCSE maths for imperial units. Next, area scale factors. The way I remember it is I write one kilometer equals a thousand meters, then I just square everything. One squared is one, kilometers squared is the units. A thousand squared, you just write the zeros out twice, and then you get meters squared. In the same way, if one meter is 100 centimeters, then one meter squared is 10,000 centimeters squared. And if one centimeter is 10 millimeters, then one centimeter squared is 100 millimeters squared. You can also call these square millimeters, square centimeters, and square meters. Volume scale factors, I do the same trick, but you cube everything this time to get that one kilometer cubed is equal to, and you write three lots of these zeros out to get a billion in this case, meters cubed. The same here, cube everything, and you get that one meter cubed is one zero 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 million centimeters cubed. And here, one centimeter cubed is, whoops, a um, thousand millimeters cubed. You can call those cubic millimetres, cubic centimetres, cubic metres. Another unit of volume that you need to know are litres. And you need to know that one litre is a thousand centimetres cubed. If you divide both sides by a thousand, that tells you that one millilitre is just one centimetre cubed. But this is the one that's helpful. For example, one metre cubed in centimetres cubed, if you want to change it into litres, you're going to have to take away three zeros at the end to get a thousand litres. Comment below if you've got any other questions about units.